And we are learning more about priests accused of sexual abuse right here in the tri-state. Not on your side, Allie Kramer joins us with the latest on this story. Allie. And Ryan, you know, at any moment we are expecting the Midwest Jesuits to actually release a list of priests facing sexual abuse allegations. And on it, we expect names of priests who have been assigned to Jesuit organizations right here in the tri-state. It will also include uh, uh, Xavier High School, Xavier University, Bellarmine Chapel at XU, St. Francis Xavier Church downtown, and the Jesuit Spiritual Center at Milford. The extensive list will include names of priests who have faced a credible accusation of sexual abuse since 1955. Now those on the list will be permanently removed from the ministry and could face criminal prosecution. The Midwest province follows the action of two other provinces who recently released lists with a combined 153 names. The Midwest Jesuits believe the release of these names increases transparency in the Catholic Church. St. Xavier High School President Tim Riley says that the, they are prepared for the names to be released. I think the list is a starting point. It's not, it's not an ending point. The list will allow people to see, oh, yep, that's if, you know, if there's somebody out there who was abused, they can say, yep, I guess they know about this guy. I don't, it's not on my shoulders anymore. Because uh, I think there's also that burden if you were abused, was somebody else also abused and I didn't say anything? Is it, you know, they shouldn't feel responsible for that. So I think it will give some peace to people who were abused. Now, St. X administrators say that they will release the list of names to both students and parents. And of course, we'll have reaction from the school. Once those names are released, our Tom McKee is following this story very closely. He'll have the latest updates at 4 o'clock on the Now Cincinnati. Ryan.